stage here at the South Pole Sharks for our first international contest. It's Australia versus Japan as Yoshihiro Moriya makes his way to centre ring. I'm Michael Chevello, ringside with my verbal spy partner Mark the Hammer Castanini, and we are joined by the K1 World Heavyweight Champion, the Dr. Mark Hunt. How are you, Mark? Hey, you going, folks? <laughs> it is great to have you in the house here at the sunny Gold Coast as we see Yoshihiro Moriya make his way to centre ring. You can see now Mark why I like to slap Savello sometimes. He gets a bit annoying. Hey, I've got, got Mark Hunt between us now. Mate, he's no gonna, touching me. He's holding me back, mate. Uh, hey, Mark Hunt's on my side tonight. Don't worry about that. Yoshihira Moria making his way to century. Mark, your next fight coming up, of course, against Gary Goodridge over in Vegas. Yeah, I'm, I'm flying over on Tuesday. I'm looking forward to this fight. I haven't been out my first outing for the year, and I'm... Uh, I've trained pretty hard for this. I got a, a bit of notice, so yeah, I'm looking forward to this fight. And now and we await the entrance of Aaron Lee. Blue corner, Aaron Lee. Oh, listen to that ovation. It can only mean one thing. Making his way to centering the ankle bite of the pocket dynamo. Too smooth, too Aaron Lee. Trained out of the strike force, Jim by Mark Peace, fresh off a of fight over in Thailand. They are raising the roof for this young fella, Aaron Lee Hammer. Well, Aaron Lee, lightning Aaron Lee, 18 fights, 15 wins. Recently returned from uh, campaign in Thailand, victorious campaign. And he's here, and he's ready to stamp his authority wow. back in Queensland. I tell you what, folks, you might need a magnifying glass to see him, but you don't need a pair of headphones to hear the sound. The applause as TS2 Aaron Lee makes his way out to centre ring. It's Australia versus Japan. It's Lee versus Moria, and it's shoot boxing at its best. Aaron Lee, the traditional Moncon, the Thai flowers around the neck. Michael Chavello, Mark Castanini, and K1 World Champion Mark Hunt ringside as Aaron Lee bows in the centre ring. And let's go to the world champion of ring announcing, Mr. Andrew J. Raymond. Ladies and gentlemen, it is it Explosion 3 here from the beautiful Gold Coast. This is our first international shoot boxing bout. It is Australia versus Japan. Ladies and gentlemen, we are scheduled for five two-minute rounds. Introducing first, representing the red corner and weighing in at 55 even kilos. He is trained out of Caesar Gym in Tokyo, Japan. 19 fights, 11 wins. The current Japanese super bantamweight shoot boxing champion. Ladies and gentlemen, a warm Queensland welcome for Yoshihiro Moiya. <laughs> Fighting out of the blue corner. He weighed in at an even 55 kilos. He is trained by Mark Pease of the Strike Force Muay Thai Gym at Mermaid Waters. 18 fights, 15 wins, 11 devastating knockouts. <laughs> he is the current WMC Australian Featherweight and IMPTD South Pacific Featherweight Champion. Ladies and gentlemen, representing the Gold Coast Queensland, Australia! Please make welcome Aaron T.S. Wow, talk about an ovation for Aaron Lee as he gets set to defend Australian pride in Captain shoot boxing. Aaron Lee's first ever shoot boxing free. contest, folks. And Hammer, talking Brad to Mark Pease earlier on, Mark Pease has said Aaron and Lee's going to Muay Thai fight Moria and not try and shoot box it. Well, probably a good game plan. They used trying to uh, take someone on at their own game, fight him at uh, what you're comfortable with, fight take him out of their comfort zone. And Aaron Lee, obviously, as I said, recently returned from a, a, good, a big campaign in Thailand. Yourself, successful bro. one. He's uh, back honed his skills. Down. They're ready to rumble against a Japanese opponent. Third man in centering, Cameron Gwynn, the Kyokushinkai legend, also fluent in Japanese. 
and we're about to get underway first of five by three and we are joined by our and guest ringside k1 world heavyweight champion the dr mark hunt Jeez, mark it's great to have you here and what a big spur on for these young fellas to have you sitting here ringside shoot boxing you would have seen plenty of it over in japan it is pretty popular over there no actually i haven't seen uh this will be my first shoot your first taste of shoot this boxing? is my first one yeah okay just do me a favor don't wear those sort of pants that uh, is wearing in during your next k1 fight i don't think i look good <laughs> with those things anyway <laughs> well this is the first of, of uh the, the two actually there was three but it's, uh, it's only two now We've got two Japanese what? opponents fronting up against the Aussies. Mm. This is the first of the round. Here we go. Outside thigh kick to open proceedings from Aaron Lee. Inside thigh kick from Moria. Snappy jab from Lee. Both are orthodox fighters. High left round kick. We've become known the round kicks of the Japanese fighters. The shoot boxes from the Takeshi Caesar gym. Very well equipped with their round kicks upstairs. Aaron Lee chopping away to the thighs, then to the upper left rib cage of Moria early on. Inside fight from Moria. Straight right hand from TS2. Well, this fight, of course, sponsored by Sapporo Beer, the Japanese imported beer mark. I suppose you've tasted quite yeah, a bit of that over there <laughs> on the K1 circuit. Quite a lot of it, yes. <laughs> the Sapporo <laughs> Beer. Thank you very much for your sponsorship. Very nice pair too. Inside Viking from Lee, trying to go the overhand elbow early on, the little ankle biter. Nice leading probing left hand there. Those awkward punches that we saw from Goto last time he fought John Wayne Parr. They look to be the number here for Yoshihiro Moria. Outside thigh kick from Moria. Inside thigh kick Aaron Lee. Straight right hand trying to plow it through the guard. Outside thigh kick from Lee. Well, Aaron Lee taking the work rate right up there early in this first round. No feeling that process. He's going for the big sub thumping right hand. Will he land the sleeping pill? As we'd say for Mark Hunt. Can Aaron Lee find it on Mori here? Oh, a nice one there for Moria. And they tie up in centering and trying to execute that take down. Right. He's done it. And of course, you can arm lock your opponent, you can neck lock your opponent, you can even leg lock your opponent Cameron under shoot boxing rules. Calling that one not clean enough. It's got to be a clean sweep, clean takedown. Oh, nice and right hand from Aaron Lee. Caught him sweetly, smack bang on the kisser. Center referee Cameron Quinn featuring on the front cover of Blitz. Martial arts break, they break. Great Cameron martial Quinn. artist in, in his own right. He is an institution in the martial arts. Nice step up hook there from Aaron Lee. Looking spot on the money here tonight so far. High left round kick off the lead leg from Moria. Oh, straight right hand from Lee. Going for the big kibosh from Moria. Looping uppercut from Moria. The Japanese fighter continues to sneak forward. Nice shot to the rib cage off the left. A pecking front kick from Moria. Two and a half minutes down. Half a minute remaining in this one. Inside thigh kick, rib kick, double kick off the lead leg from Aaron Lee. Looking the good so far. High left down kick from Lee. Controlling the centre of the ring. Jab, right combination. Round kick just tucking under the left arm of Moria. Good work rate so far from Aaron Lee. Picking the marks, finding the opening. Outside thigh kick to the lead thigh. Well, 55 kilos apiece, these two boys. that would be the weight of one of your arms, Mark, I think. But not, uh, not a lot of weight in them, but I tell you what, a lot of heart and a lot of great skill from both these uh, lightweight fighters. I don't even want to feed it. Hey, I can make as many food analogies as I like tonight, Hammond. You can't say anything about it. Not with Mark Hunt sitting between us. End of the first round of action. Mark, how did you think of that one? What did you think of the Aussie boy, Aaron Lee? Well, uh, oh, it's really good skill, both of them. Um, yeah, I'd, I'd say the... Aaron, Aaron Lee with that. We have Aaron Lee because he did a lot more work, I'd say. Okay, a 10 9 round for Mark Hunt. Let's listen in now. And then follow up onto the legs. All right, you know what I'm talking about? Fake the jab. He's going to cover up. So go towards the midsection, then use an overhand elbow. Remember? Jab, rip, overhand. Jab, rip, overhand. Like Doesn't like being in the grapple. So jab, rip, overhand, and jab, rip, overhand elbow. Wrap into him. Relax, me and Hammer the instructions there from Mark Pees on Aaron Lee. Mark Pease, obviously one of the one of the great trainers of Muay Thai in Queensland and indeed Australia, certainly schooling uh, Lee in premium Thai technique. Just having a look at the replay here, Morio trying to uh, execute the throw, but Lee working the knee strikes underneath it, and Morio just not 
being able to settle and use his shoot fighting te techniques. Brazil just kept the tight technique going, kept the punches and kicks working in close, knees underneath. Really didn't let the Japanese uh, opponent settle at all. Comments from the former Australian cruiserweight Muay Thai champion, the Hammer. Mark Castanini inside with myself, Michael Chevello, and our special guest, the Doctor, the K1 World Heavyweight Champion, Mark Hunt. Here we go, second of five. Inside thigh kick, Moria. Outside thigh kick for the lead thigh from Aaron. Oh, he's caught him with a rip kick. Down goes Moria. I think, I think the knee actually connected oh, with the jaw. He's caught him, and Moria splashed to the canvas like a Ken Dome painting. Can he get up? He's on rubber leg street. It's all over. It's good night, Aaron. Oh, OK, no victory to Aaron Lightning Lee. TS2. Who's moved to Aaron Lee? It was a round kick shot at the ribs. Moria ducked, and I think the knee caught the Japanese fighter on the jaw, and the, the shin crashed into the ribs. It was a double whammy there from Aaron Lee, but sent Moria down. Mark Hunt, the K1 World Champion. What did you think of that one, Doc? Well, yeah, uh, did it last time. Second round, it was a, it was a good move and paid off. He's got some power for a little fella, hasn't he, Aaron Lee? Well, so great knockout win for him, Hammer. Certainly, uh, Aaron Lee sticking to the game plan of fighting Thai boxing. We'll see Aaron Lee just stepping up now. We'll have a close look at it. Checks. Bang. I think the knee caught uh, Moria on the jaw as the shin crashed in on the ribs. It was a double whammy effect on the Japanese fighter. There it is. Hard to see, but certainly did the damage. And Aaron Lee timed it sweetly, sticking to his Muay Thai tactics. Oh. It was the knee that caught the jaw. Bang, and down went the Japanese fighter. Wow, what a sensational knockout. And that's 1-0 to the Aussies here tonight. The cup's almost bigger than Aaron Lee there. <laughs> Look at that one. And also 100 from and 100 from Richard Bell. He's got more flowers around his neck on a florist. Throwing money at him. Almost have as much money as you now, wouldn't you, Mark? <laughs> hey, Aaron, throw their money this way, man. You don't want it? <laughs> Well, there it is, folks. It's 1-0 to Australia. Aaron Lee by KO over Yoshihira Moria. Ladies and gentlemen, at an official time, 29 seconds, round number two, your winner. And kicking off Australia's score, Aaron TS2. spoke in the opening of our telecast, shoot boxing, something very familiar to the Japanese. We're very much still on our L plates, but you look like a very qualified driver. No, I just try to stick with what I know and try not to do anything stupid. It's slow, but oh well. It's a case of sticking to what you know best and trying to avoid what they know best. That's right, so I don't confuse myself. Definitely. And you did a fabulous job, Aaron Lee, victorious. Thank you. I'd just like to thank Wendy as well. And happy birthday, Johnny. Thanks everyone for coming and Mark and all the boys, my parents.